Hello everybody! Hi everyone! I'm Stella. I'm Tarrant. From Mipo University. Welcome to our live playthrough on a Sunday morning our time or your Saturday evening or whatever time you are, wherever you are. Yeah. Please say hello in the chat room. We'd like to say hello to you as well. Yeah. I forgot to bring the box up. <laughs> Make this look cool. Okay. <laughs> Ta -da! Today we'll be playing Volcanic, Volcanic Oil. Oil. This, is, um, this was released I think a couple of years ago it was no we first played this at origin last year yeah origins 19 we yeah. uh, demo we we didn't demo it we played a demo of it correct yeah. and this is by Ark and wonders now I feel like this game needs deserve more attention hence we're playing this today and yeah. with Ark and wonders um, also providing a copy of the giveaway worldwide to one lucky winner so this game's already out so you should you don't na need to wait until this game's out like some of our um, giveaways yep. so yeah so uh, hopefully this is um, you know hopefully we kind of like convince you a little bit to just have a look and yep. have a play perhaps and enjoy the uh, menacing Easter Island heads here yeah. So how's everyone going? I just want to know how um, we are here still in lockdown in Melbourne. So hopefully they just extended it, I think. It was meant to, is today the 13th? It was today? meant to end, it was meant to end today. Today mm. was the original end mm. date for stage four. But yes. uh, I think there's still about 40 cases a day here. So mm. it is extending for another couple of weeks. Yep. And saying hello mm. to Toki, Yoga and James, how are you? Uh, we also uh, multi stream this to Board Game Arena's Twitch, by the way, but I have to manually look at it so it doesn't mm -hmm. actually get, the comments doesn't get pushed like um, the rest of you in the, in the screen here. So oh, if you look at, if you see me doing this and then look at that, that means I'm just checking the chat, which I like to do. Yes. So Terran, shall we get on the game, straight away on the game? Yeah, let's go straight to it. Let's, let's introduce it. Yeah. So the game is called Volcanic Isle and it is a... It's hard to how to describe it. It's sort of an area influence building game uh, where we're going to be building where these settlers who are coming to the island, which has eight volcanoes on it. It's so cute. Um, and there's little settlers. And you can see here we've got these uh, lovely little 3D volcano pieces. Mm -hmm. Go back to that. Let's show that again because it's kind of cool. Oh yeah, okay. I'll go back that. to the side. You see we've got these uh, 3D volcano pieces that are it's a bit glass, on the board sorry. here. Here. Um, so it's a dangerous island that we're <laughs> heading to. Yeah. Um, okay, so we'll go back to the... Okay, before anyone's make any joke, the lava around the volcano um, looks like um, something, but, um, you know, don't, don't have dirty minds. Please don't have dirty minds. This is a child-friendly channel. <laughs> so, yes, okay. Um, yeah. Well, just in case, you know, maybe people don't notice that, but I'll just say that. Um, and James said, doing well, just got a bunch of gaming in over the last couple of weeks, finally. Yay! We love that. Very we love good. to hear that you're having fun, uh, looking after yourself, and also um, play games with friends, families, online, physical. It's good to know. All right, Taryn, I'll let you go. Do it. Continue. Yeah, so we're each going to turn up on this island with one settler. Uh, we're, and there's eight volcanoes and there's a whole lot of lava that's already been spewed by these volcanoes. <gasps> lava means rock and rock means building materials. So we're going to be uh, using up all these bits of lava that are all over the island to build villages. Mm -hmm. Little villages. And to build some moai, some Easter Island heads. Uh, and we're going to be uh, building all of these in order to try to score points. Like his mind. Look, look how cool they are. <laughs> um, but it is a volatile island and when we start uh, raising these heads we're going to be raising them on top of these fire geysers and that is going to put pressure down onto the lava beneath the earth and start to split the island apart so we're going to get all of these fissures falling all over the island yeah. that's going to stop us from moving and eventually it's going to sink the island so every time uh, a major part of this game so a major part of the game is scoring points for building things, but then you want to keep them on the board because if a small part of the island gets completely separated by fissures, it sinks. Anything on that is gone for final scoring purposes. And that's a major part of the game is mm -hmm. uh, trying to cut off your opponent's stuff. <laughs> it's very cutthroat. Without cutting off your own. We played with 
uh, two players, we play with four players, we play with three players. We thought that two players is not going to be cutthroat, but it is so cutthroat still. Yeah, two players is a very uh, direct competitive area influence game. Mm -hmm. um, it, you know, it goes to that whole thing of two player play where harming your opponent is as valuable as benefiting yourself. Yeah. Uh, in a three or four player game, it's more about benefiting yourself and minimizing the harm from opponents. So it actually Good plays uh, quite well at both mm -hmm. player counts, but it's a different sort of experience. That's uh, true. All right. Um, every time we put... The other thing we have to watch out for is the volcanoes. So whenever yeah. we open up a fissure, uh, one random volcano is going to erupt and that could swallow up our villages and our... Um, and our Moai. So it um, we'll play until there's only two volcanoes left on the island. Mm -hmm. We score for whatever's left on the island. And we see who wins from that. So, mm -hmm. yes. Okay, who's, let's rock, paper, scissors. Who goes first? Yep. One, two, three. I go first. You cover. <laughs> I cover okay. you with paper. Yeah. All right. Um, so it is a, it's an action point allocation game. Uh, you'll have four action points per round, which mm -hmm. can be used to move, mm -hmm. build a village for two action points, mm -hmm. build a moai for one, raise that moai for one, um, produce new settlers from a village, or you can get a prayer token. Mm -hmm. These can uh, help save your assets from the eruptions. I'm going to do it later. I'm going to explain the rest later. Yep. So I'm just going to jump on it. Yep. And there's one last thing I'm just going to oh, say yep, from sorry. terminology perspective. Um, there's a difference between areas and spaces in this game. So an area is a single tile. You can sort of see these are, uh, these tiles are broken up. Some of them have multiple hexes or multiple spaces on them. Yes. Um, and then, yeah, hexes or spaces are the individual hexes. And, uh, the rules, there are times where that distinction is very important. Got it. All right, my go. So I have four action points each turn. So I'm the first player here. So I'm going to move. So the first step is to move it to one of these three um, areas, spaces. spaces, yeah. So I'm going to try to move probably, uh, this is kind of like safe because there's no going to be volcano eruption and so on. So I'm probably going to move here. Um, I can move here, but I think I'm going to start building a uh, something there. It's just the increase my population. So, um, so to move there, one point. To build that, that's two points. Okay, and that has to uh, absorb that's one correct. of these lavas, yep. and then I'll just put it goes in the channel. Yep. Yeah, I'll take this over here. Yes, keep it close to us. Yeah, here, and then um, I've got, I've got one more point. This is good. Like I, if I don't have this, I probably forget because there are times where you don't do it consecutively. Yeah, do it in different order, and then the next one. Um, now, do I want to build a thing? Yes, I think I want to do that. So I'll build that there. So just building there, but it's not erecting yet because I need, I'm out of action, um, action point to actually erect it. So yep. that's basically it, the end of my turn. So I'm going to refresh all yep. these action points. Okay. I'm going to start in a very similar way. Uh, getting villages and settlers is a useful way to kick things off. Mm -hmm. So I'll do one action point to move in there. I'll spend two action points to build a village here. And I will go straight in and uh, create another settler. Wow, so nice. So to create a settler is one action point. Mm -hmm. You need to be in a hex with a village and another settler. Mm -hmm. And you can only use each village once per round. Not a bad choice, Taryn. All right, now my go again. So the first one is I do want to do this. You can only, I should have probably done that because it's only one per turn, so I could have done more, but that's okay. So once to do that, the next one, I want to get a prey token, please. Okay. So the first one is one, but the second one's cost me two action points, which is, it's getting, basically the prey tokens is getting more and more expensive. Hello, Sean, how are you going? So I've been talking to Sean as well um, mm -hmm. about something, uh, technical um, ideas. So, um, mm -hmm. so Sean's helping us with that. So hopefully it's not too hard for Sean to help us with the something, something. I don't know if I should say it or not. Sean can tell if, if, he, if he wants to. Anyways, <laughs> so I've got that. So this is why if I get distracted, yes. I know that I've got two I was two thinking more. that exactly. <laughs> Good thinking. Forgotten something, something already. Yes. 
I'm very bad with forgetting this oh, in yeah. this game. You do get points okay. as we go along. Yeah. So we each uh, gained one point for building those villages. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot about that. So I don't get the points here until... Whoop, and Dermot, hello from Ireland. What time is it there? It must be really late. Must be midnight-ish, I wow. think. Wow, okay. Nine hours... Welcome. Nine hours behind. Nine hours behind. I think. Ireland is like... Europe usually like very... Uh, we've got a few years in uh, Netherlands and she can't really stay up. Too, too late, yes, late. it's even an hour. No, it must be further mm -hmm. high. Mm -hmm. It's it's late. Thanks yeah. for joining us. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> so, next one is, um, I've got two more points. Um, I want to try to actually carry this, because I can. So with one point, I carry uh, this here. Yep. Sorry, uh, so in here. Uh, there's no lava channel to place it there. There's no lava channel. Oh, so you have point. to place it in the actual lava channel. I believe so. Sorry, everybody. Just checking the rules now. So I do want to check that, actually. <laughs> oh, just after midnight. I've always played it that way. But. Well, Ch Taryn's checking the rules. I'm going to give you the password to enter this uh, giveaway for this game. So uh, email us to meeple.university.giveaway at hotmail.com with the uh, subject line Easter Island. Who, um, thanks to Arkham Wonders, who will send the winner a copy of Volcanic Isle. Um, so don't forget to do that, and we'll draw it at the end of the game. Um, hopefully everyone enters and is saying hello in the chat room. You know what, the, um, the rules do not strictly say mm -hmm. that you... It says you can carry a Moai to an adjacent space. Yeah. Um, so I guess... But it doesn't strictly say you have to place it in a lava channel. So... So I can? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's play that we can. Uh, and then I will erect it here. Ding ding. Yep, so that's your fourth action. Yep. And then give me one point. Yes, so a moai when you raise it is worth one point. Uh, it's worth it's worth a minimum of one point. Yes. But when we build more, mm -hmm. it's it's worth the number of villages on that area, mm -hmm. which in this case is both of these tile or mm -hmm. both of these hexes, mm -hmm. multiplied by the number of moai mm -hmm. raised in that area. So um, a fissure appear here because I raised it here. Yep. So you gained your point, created a fissure, and then I roll a die. Roll to see if there's an eruption. So there's Ooh. a four in six chance, a two in three chance for you. Uh, ah, positions. sorry. Ah, oh, you knocked me down. <laughs> okay. And then now <laughs> I and we got the eruption top. token. Yes. Hello. So two five two five three two Rob H one is from US. Elliot, hello, and there's Lillian, there's Wayan as well, hello. Oh. Wayan, we haven't got it, whatever that you sent on the mail, sorry. I know you're going to ask. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's quite normal if it's like a normal local mail. It's just taking like one month plus to get through, I think. Yeah, the mail, okay. mail system's got a lot going on. Number five. Place. So I drew number five. So number five, um, around it is the... Fi the lava is already full, so we don't add another lava. Yep. But that that can potentially destroy buildings and such if you build it there. And yep. that's where, why the prey tokens is handy. Yes, which I'll move back onto the mm -hmm. board so people can see it. Yes, so yep. the um, each time a fissure opens, mm -hmm. there'll be a potential eruption, which will bring new lava into play and can destroy things. Yoo but number five is mm -hmm. full, so no new lava. Yeah. All right. And that is the end of your turn. Yeah. I'm going to remove these boats because they're only used in the start of the game. Yeah. And they're Good point. Filling up the space. Mm. All right. I use Taryn's been the space Nazi in these games. He's usually the one that set up the game and, and stuff, and I do the technical part of it. Yeah. <laughs> We've got a very like the score sheet fits perfectly in the corner. It cannot be nudged. Okay. Well, I was moving the camera before. Well, anyways, <laughs> uh, we use something different. So. Um, it looks like there's no issue though, so but if there's issue, let us know. Like it was frozen before, so we use some um, different thing in today's stream. Usually, like every single thing that you do something different, it affects it. Like last time I stream, I I've got new video card, and then it just froze. I'm like, what's going on? And I have to change something, and then it's all good now. And from mistakes. And saying hello to Oliver and um, yeah, why I'm sorry. Hopefully soon. Mm. All right, what do we do now? All right, I am going to, I want to get, we have five settlers that mm -hmm. we can have in the game. I've got two of mine out. I want to get them out quickly 
And I don't mind if this bit gets cut away, I just want to use it to get my settlers out. Mm -hmm. So, my first action is going to be to use this village to bring yep. another settler. And then, my next action... Bexie, um, Bexie? No, I, I was always going to do that. Mm -hmm. no, I'll stick to that plan. I'll spend two actions to use up this lava here to build a Ooh. village. Because these are safe villages as well. They're not on a volcano's area, so That's they're not going to get swallowed. Mm -hmm. So I get one point from my village. Yep. And then I'm going to use my new village to bring my fourth settler wow. into play. Wow. That's very good. So you have one more off board that you can build there. Yes. Okay, that's uh, that's you done. Yes. You've reset all your action points. Yes. And I will do this. So when does the game end? Uh, the game end is triggered when only two volcanoes remain on the island, mm -hmm. and uh, we each have the same number of turns. Oh yeah. So this is like indication that I'm the first. I was the first player. I yes. am the first player. All right, my go. So first one is I'm going to bring the set settlers in there. Mm -hmm. And the second one is I'm going to, what am I going to do? I'm going to move the settlers, I guess. No. This is interesting. Okay. I'm probably going to move this one. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to, next one is to build this. Okay, so that needs to go on one of the lava channels. Yeah, sorry. And, and it, it consumes some lava. Mm -hmm. And then the next one is I'm gonna bring it up. Again, I don't have a, um, I don't have a village there, so maybe I should probably bring village first. That's an interesting. Maybe I should do that. Sorry, taxi backsy. Uh, and then I just build a village. There you go. It's one point for me. We'll see what happened. Okay. Don't want to think about it too much. Okay. So you're on three points, one, two, three, yes. yes. Okay. All right. Action one is to finish off my uh, army of settlers. Yeah. Although, I am gonna take that one back because I've got time to deal with that. What I wanna do, these lavas are never gonna refill and you're hovering and I want to generate some moai and have control mm -hmm. over this area. So I'm gonna do one. Oh no, I still have the actions for it, so that's okay. Mm -hmm. Although, no, I will do it this way. One, two. Even though I don't have to have separate settlers to build these two moai, mm -hmm. I'm going to do it because they can both carry them. Correct. One settlers per, I don't know how they do it, but apparently they can carry. Yes. And build moai. Yes. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to, yes, move two and raise two moai. I will say, we've, I mentioned this in a, in a vlog a few months ago, but there's something I enjoy about the four actions per turn action pandemic. point allowance style pandemic of game. Style, yeah. Yeah, Pandemic and um, Cave Troll and like it um, on the underground. Just that thing of having four action points and not being able to quite do everything you want. Uh, well, maybe three. Three, maybe three. Well, there are other mechanics where you can do three and then you can get an action point so that you can use it later on in the game. And that are actually also like, like Solar Storm and the Midnight Murder Mystery, which has got a French version already and coming yeah. on Kickstarter for English. So that sort of thing. Yeah. Um, also, I do want to ask, hey, Joy, how's it going? Joy, this is oh. just, Joy, this is uh, from Facebook. Um, I want to know if... Actually, this is like off topic. I want your opinion if you would play. It's been a while since we host Welcome to or even Cartographer. I want to know if this is something that you want to play with us. Like it's a like a play along type of thing rather than play along, rolling right. Well, yeah. I mean, last week, last week we did a play along exit the game. Yes. And I'm thinking about play along. Throw in the comments um, if that's something that you would like to join. So similar time, similar. Um, days, uh, yeah, let us know. And whether it's welcome to or photographer. Yes. What other ones are there? I think those two are the main one that people are mostly familiar with and yeah. can download the... Yeah, and there's no, and those are true um, common action. Yeah. 
games as well that don't have a uh, drafting component. That's true, yeah. All right. Um, so, R.A. Hopkins, so I wasn't the only one on Facebook watching. No, you're not the only one. People just uh, don't say hello, but say hello. And we'll just say hello back. All right, that's my turn now. Yes. Terence is already building in the stuff there. We've got a big little coastal colony going on mm -hmm. here. Exactly. It's very susceptible, with one menacing head there. It's very susceptible one. to uh, yep. sinking them. So now I also have four settlers on the island, the same with Tarrant. And then number two. Number three. Oh yeah, thank you. And then just build it in here, please. Okay, so that's, I've got one, still one point, right? Uh, yes, one oh, yeah, point. I forgot about that. Ah, never mind. <laughs> Okay. And then, and then create a fissure there. Fissure comes here. So maybe here, what's going on here? Maybe I try to cut Terence off the island. Maybe I don't know. Like I can't really do anything, and un unless if I build it somewhere and then carry it here, which is possible. Yep. Um, then. So that means Terence can't. Terran settlers can't also go here or here. So you must go this way and that way. Yep. All right. Mm -hmm. Then we roll the eruption die. Ooh. Oops, off camera, but it is. Yep. All right, um, number three. So number three is this one here. Yep. Uh, no one's in danger, but mm. we do get two new lavas here. So a lot of resources there on tile yeah. three. Hello, Fate. Good afternoon. Uh, <laughs> Hello, Geekcraft gamers are here as well. Uh, just. And demo just play photographers today for the BGG monthly comp. I'll play along if I'm still up. Okay, good to know. Thank you. There you go. And um, so we're in. Hello. Uh, that you is have one, one more. more. Yeah, this is a good thing again that I can track this. Uh, well, that's the thing though. If I go there, if this is erupted, then if I haven't erected the. Like, I can't build more here because there's no more lava and there's not possible to have more lava because there's no volcano there. Um, so I've done that. Maybe I'll just do this for my last action. That's it. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's so all my settlers. Five settlers. Yes. All right. Now, the, I'll, I'll just explain. There are a couple mm. things I need to be. Uh, concerned about here because when you get cut off everything you've built is going to sink um, your settlers if you're the one who does the cutting off mm -hmm. the, the active player gets to save all settlers that were cut off whereas the uh, any passive players can only save one settler per area so if Stella were to cut me off right now I would lose two of my settlers and Really, that's going to put me like three or four turns behind because I spent a lot of time getting these settlers. Mm -hmm. So it's something I need to be very careful of. Um, fortunately, I can see that Stella is incapable of raising both of those right in now. one turn. Because yeah. there's no lava there. She would have to go one, two, three, four. So, And I can cut this off at any time I want because I've got... Two Moai here, I can go one, two to move them here and then raise them both and sink them and move everyone. So mm -hmm. um, that's a reasonable position for me, mm -hmm. at least for one turn. Mm -hmm. Hello, Sabrina and Matthew. Everyone's here. Everyone's here now, almost everyone. Uh, a little bit blight, but here in Sabrina, this game layout looks similar to Tikal. We play Tikal. We play Tikal too. We haven't played Tikal. That's Tikal right, one. yes. It is a different game, but I can see the, some of the resemblance, kind of like the theme side mm. of it. All right, my first action is to create a new settler. Yo. Um, these two Moai are no use where they are. Yes. So, two, three. Just bring them over here. So what's the first action? Uh, to bring a settler. So all five of my settlers are on mm -hmm. the board now. This is a very crowded area for Terran here. Very crowded indeed. Um, mm -hmm. And then my fourth one, I'm going to... I'm going to start branching out. 
mm-hmm. and bring my uh, my Y with me because that'll probably get sunk at some point. Mm-hmm. Okay. Four. All right, Done. my go. <laughs> it looks like I'm gonna try to sing Tarrant here. <laughs> like as I say, what did I say? Cutthroat. Yes. Hmm. It's like whether you concentrate on your own, like you can, you know, kind of like in two players, you can try to separate, but then at some point you would need to separate the island because that's one of the objectives and you need to raise more eye, which is going to cause yeah. the rift and so on. Yeah. We're, and you've got to be very careful because it's the smaller half of the island that drops. And when we played a couple days ago, I spent a lot of effort trying to sink like a third of the island that you were on, but then you are in the stronger position to sink over half of what was left where my stuff was, and I ended up losing. Mm, it's really close though. It was very close. Mm. Three. If I raise it here, I'll lose my Moai. Correct. But I think I'll do that. Okay. Sorry, parent. So that's four actions. So I believe one, two, three, four, yep. And yep. then that's one action for me. One point. And then the Fisher appears. Fisher appears. Um, and I can still like, I can say if, if you sink this, I can still go there, right? Yes. One, okay. Yeah, you can move to an adjacent area. Mm -hmm. All right, let's roll the eruption die. Ooh, okay, uh, where do I roll? Yeah. Yep. And let's see which one erupts it. Number seven. Seven. Seven is, is over here. Yeah. So nearby, it's just going to add this one two and new lines. This one, yeah. That's the yeah. And okay. oh, there's somewhere from Twitch as well. Hello. TJ Grief. Oh, it was, it's good to see everyone's coming from different platforms and so this we're using Restream so good to see that it, it works. Alright. Mm -hmm. So it's now my turn. Your mm -hmm. actions are done. So one of the I guess one of the benefits of sinking your own area mm -hmm. is free movement. Correct. So by sinking this area myself, I'm actually saving four action points. I'm losing the villages I built, right. but I'd be saving four action points because I get four free moves. Mm -hmm. So that's obviously what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. um, I will, I can raise this Moai to get two points off these villages, mm -hmm. or I can try to raise it outside and score it at the end of the game. Um, that's probably a good idea, yeah. Well done, I should have done the other way. You but can I never be sure about the end of the game. Correct. Well, I left over are going to be worth two points or four if they're adjacent to another one mm -hmm. of yours. I'm going to raise it inside. I'm going to go for the instant gratification. Mm -hmm. So one action to do that. That's a lot of points there. Like I get three? two points. Is that two? You got, oh, you got two, two times villages one is multiplied two. Yep. By one. So that creates the fissure. Mm -hmm. um, and I think the fissure resolves before the eruption. How many points memory. have you... If you used uh, just the one, just the one to stand it up, yeah, and <laughs> rumble, rumble, rumble. So this goes this away. Part of the island is sunk. sinking, sunk now. All right, so mm -hmm. I get to move all of my um, settlers to yep. an adjacent area. Good thing that you've built all your settlers to already. An adjacent space. Mm -hmm. And me too. I get to build, uh, move it somewhere. Yeah. I'm going to... Who, who does that first? It doesn't really matter, does it? Maybe there's a rule. I don't know. I'm going to move them into there. Okay, I'm going to move it into here. Same. Okay, so this all gone. Yep. Sinking, gone. We do get our goodies back. Yep. And that's uh, out of the game. Yep, and then we do the eruption. No eruption. No eruptions. All right. And how many have you done? Just one? That was one action. Oh, so very now I need to figure out what I'm going to do next. Mm -hmm. So, my second action point, I'm going to move here. Mm -hmm. My third and fourth action points, I'm going to build a village. 
That does put me at risk without a prayer token, though. Yeah, maybe get a prayer token first. So instead, I uh, instead of spending two, two on that, because there's enough lava there at mm -hmm. the moment, it's relatively protected. So I'll spend one to move another settler up there. Mm -hmm. Really, I'll move him there. And then my fourth one to get a prayer token. Very good. Okay. My go. Your go. I will. So how many points do I get for uh, these buildings again? Uh, at, at the, the end, end of the, the game, game yeah. a leftover settler mm -hmm. is worth four points. So you don't want to lose your settlers. And uh, a leftover village, village is worth three. Okay. A leftover moai is worth two, two and an adjacent or four if it's adjacent to another one of yours. So these two here are worth four points each. Yeah, as if at they the moment. Survive. Yeah, that's correct. All right, in that case, I will start planning what I'm going to do now, which is I don't know yet. All right, I'm going to move one. And I'm going to build... I want to build two. Which channel? Oh yeah. Well, wait, wait a minute. Wait. Uh, let's do this one. Two. Yep. And then the third one, I'm gonna stand it up to face this way. And very quickly. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we've got Fisher there. That's one point for me. I remember. Yep, and roll the... The Doom Dice. No, nice. no safe. Option. Yep. And then I've got one more, which I am going to... Probably move this guy. Yeah. Okay. Okay, all done. Your go now. Okay, you're filling up this area. It's going to make it harder to score off. Oh, you'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'll do, I'll spend two mm -hmm. to build a village here. Yeah. So that's uh, one point. I wonder if people from Board Game Arena Twitch can hear us, hear, hear us or see us. I can see 211 views there, but you know, maybe if someone there can say hello just to see if it's working and you can hear us, you can see us and so on. Mm -hmm. That will be awesome. All right, one point there. Yeah. And then. What What did you do, sorry? I got distracted. I built a sorry, village. Tara. I'm going to build okay, yeah. two villages. I'm going to try to mm -hmm. score some quick points from villages. Very good. So that's uh, another point. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, reset. Yes. Mm, I did a boo-boo. Never mind. Uh, no, I didn't. So I will first build a moai here. One point. Second one is to move the moai here. Yep. Third one is to erect. Okay. I don't know. I have not really a strategy, but kind of like see what happened because the strategy always changes depending on what your opponent's doing. So interaction is very high. All yep, right. So that's uh, one point. Oh yeah. Thank you for that. Reminding me. Oop. And an eruption. Yeah. We'll see if Taran's is safe or not. Ah! Oh, it's got to be that one then. <laughs> Number two. Number two up here. Okay. So one new lava comes into play. Yeah. Is this kind of like a faint sort of like uh, lava lava channel channel there? Yeah. All right. Okay. And one more. One more. Hmm. What more is? Oh, sorry. This is not meant to happen. Oh, come on, stand up. One more is I will move my person here. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's your done. Yes, thank you. Now I... Thomas, hello Thomas. 
Oh, okay, so that's Thomas. Uh, the components look good. Are there prototypes or finished version? This is finished version. So yeah, for or for those who join us, um, this is the finished version. The game is out for Kenic Owl out oh, was that thing again this box um it was out a few years last year or something along those lines like that thanks oh sorry it's upside down uh we flipped the camera so yeah this is um this been about for a while for uh, by i can wonders so this is uh definitely a finished version yes it's like we see this 3d is good table presence you see it from the side as well sorry about the glare at the top there but that's basically it our village yeah. mm. <laughs> <laughs> just villages all right, you'll All go. All right, what am I going to do? There's a whole lot of lava over here, mm -hmm. and it's sort of setting up that that side's going to cut off. Um, so I might try to capitalize on that. There's no geyser here, so if I want to cut this side off, I've got to jump over. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to do that. One to move over there. So we're working together sort of now. You might as well not against nature, right? <laughs> exactly. We've got to both make the best of this situation. Exactly. Two to raise that, so that's one point mm -hmm. for me. Oh, sorry. Uh, two? I mean, do you say two points or one, one point? One point. Okay, yeah. Like, Second oh. action, sorry. Oh, sorry, yes. All right, so that goes there. Mm -hmm. We'll see if we have an eruption. We yes, do. do. I think this is my first eruption. Mm-hmm. Number seven, seven, which is where I am. So yep. one more lava comes onto the board Ooh. there. A lot of building materials there. A lot. Mm -hmm. What can I do with it is the question. Mm. And you got two more, do you? I have two more. Yeah. And with that, I'm going to move. Thomas said, yeah. "Haven't seen it before." Yes, that's. This is the thing. Um, we feel like this is a really good game for two players, three players, four players, but it is quite underrated because I uh, don't think a lot of people know about it. What am I going to do here? I'm going to spend my third action to. Build and don't forget to um, email us, everybody, in the, the below. Yep. While well, Taryn does a turn. And my. Fourth action mm -hmm. is going to be to drag it in here. Ooh. Okay. All right. Yep, done. Yep, so uh, if you do want to enter mm -hmm. for the worldwide giveaway of a copy of Volcanic Isle from Arcane mm -hmm. Wonders, mm -hmm. then please email with the subject line Easter Island to us at meeple.university.giveaway at hotmail.com. That's the email that uh, we usually just use for giveaway. So if you've got any other things, um, email us at meeple.uni at gmail.com. Yes, not confusing at all. Yes, not. <laughs> it's so confusing. All right, first action is, uh, let me switch that off. Hmm. Do I want to do this? First action is to build a moai here. Yep. Second action is to erect it here. Yep. Okay. Um, where is that thing here? Boop. Very good. So mm -hmm. that is one point. Thank you for reminding me that. And then roll the dice. Yes. Yep. We have an eruption. I will take this one. Number eight. Number eight, over here. Yeah. The untouched part of the island. Ooh. Of course, once, uh, once some of these volcanoes start dropping off the island, mm -hmm. uh, they, they come out of this little deck. So those that remain are going to get more active. And then my next action is to raise another moai here, put it here in that channel. Yep. And to, uh, to build, and then the next one is to raise it. Hmm. Which is right here. Okay, so that's another one point. Mm -hmm. For me, and then roll the dice. And I should really get people to choose a number from one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But then again, it'll probably take a while. So get the number for next time, but this time I'll just pick it at random. Mm -hmm. How's that? So if somebody can write a number in the comments, and then we'll pick that number from 
top to bottom counting it and the one that's going to be erupted is number seven everybody which is over where i am yeah which is there's already four. nothing happens some ways are for uh, is safe it's just that the villagers said it's not that safe all right um that is more all my go yep um ugh. <laughs> it's like ooh. Six. Okay, YM said six. So the next time we'll pick number six after we shuffle this. Thank you, YM. How's the baby, YM? Hopefully, um, hopefully you can tend to uh, your baby as well. How old is it? And, you know, is it a girl or a boy? Let us know. Hmm. I just said it, sorry. I was like, how old is she or he? Because I think in Indonesia, there's no... Uh, that's where i originally from. There's no... He or she, it's just like just one person. It doesn't matter whether male or female. So just, yeah. So like, there's no difference, um, difference between yeah, male or female. So uh, there are times where I kind of like, I have to think about it still, occasionally. Sleeping, all princesses, no. They are better, okay, so it's amazing. A busy good mum all right so that is well and fully shoveled and then we'll pick number six next time okay oh, Wyan has got so range 2 to 16 wow so 2 to 16 years old that's amazing 16 mm. yeah mm. I thought like it's like two months or something like that <laughs> I don't know you done what you done? Sorry. Um, I was thinking because yes. I can see a very bad strategic position um, setting itself up on this board for me. So what's um, what did you do? So my first action there? is I'm going to raise a moai there oh, yeah. uh, and drop this fissure here. Mm -hmm. That is worth two points to me. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> and there is an eruption, so it's the sixth from the top. One, two, three, so four, a good mom. five, six. Yeah. Number six. So oh, number six is six. Wow. Yep. Well so we need uh, a couple of lavas up here. Yeah, that's basically full now. Yep. All right. Um, it's good. It's like um, there's a few uh, range two to six girls. It's gonna be fun. Like my mom has got two sisters. Well, your parents have got two brothers. Yes. Oh. Mm. Second action to go up there. Third action to build a moai. Mm -hmm. And fourth action to bring it back down here. Oh. Okay. Okay. Done. My go? Yeah. Right. So if this one's gone, then I can still move you can across. Still save that set. Though, so yes. it's fine. Okay, I can just leave it and not waste any turn then. Uh, but what am I going to do now? Okay, I think I'm gonna move this person here for one action build a thank you more here for a second action and then erect it here for the third action so thank you that's another one point for me thank you for reminding me again it's stuck yep they Sorry, stick no, it's not. <laughs> and, and let's roll this guy. hello marie hello Eruption. Eruption. All right, we'll take, take a random one this time. And number three. Number three. Oh, All no. right, so this is where I now have to. Oh, well, uh, you got the thing to spend. I got the prayer token. Yeah. So I'll spend that. That prevents this from getting destroyed. Mm -hmm. uh, we do still get a lava down here. Yep. And another one here. Okay. So that's actually. That brings a whole lot, that brings more building materials mm -hmm. into play here, which is where want. I want them, that's mm, for sure. Okay. Um, I've got one more. Which I'll do this and... 
that's a risk though if you know I've, I've got this to save if I want to so let's yeah. just do that okay be risky yep all right now I can see oh uh, so Thomas is uh, say that uh, we'll be playing fickle and Shelia later perhaps trouble shuffle as well that's awesome Shelly, is it Shelly or Warring States? Yeah, we played yeah. that one recently. It's and it's kind of also underrated. I think that's a really neat good little and battle game. Oh, nice it's good. They're going to have the expansion, this Kickstarter, coming out soon. Yeah. Uh, and Trouble sure. Shuffle, uh, that's the one that I haven't. It might actually be coming um, on the way to us with Mariposa, I'm not too sure. I'm not In familiar with that. Is that a Goonies game? It's a, it's a new game with a chocolate. Okay. Trouble Shuffle. I want to play that. I'm surprised it's not a Goonies game. I'm sure that'll come. Why is it Goonies? Um, that's the... I forget the, the kid's scene. name, but that's the dance he does. The oh, is it called Travel Shuffle? Travel Shuffle. Oh, I think probably so. Ravensburger or, you know, Prospero Hall might probably do... Oh, hang on, this, this, the Goonies is the game in here, in a way, I is think. Is it? Okay. I don't know. If you know, let us know. <laughs> All right. All right. Now, mm -hmm. I need to start getting some adjacent Moai. So I'm going to do one action to move this guy down here, mm -hmm. and the second action to erect this here. Mm -hmm. So I get four points for that uh, because I've got. You destroy my thing. So I get four points because I've got. Wow. That's my second moai in this area, and I've got two one, villages. Two, three, four. Well done. Uh, it's, not a, it's not a snake. Oh, it's not. Sorry. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, and then this area <laughs> sinks. But you do get to save that uh, settler mm -hmm. to an adjacent space. Regardless yeah. of the... Um, Oops, so you get your pieces back. Thank you. And then we roll for the eruption. Mm -hmm. So there will be an eruption. What number is that? Hopefully not three, because I didn't go Same. in advance. <laughs> I don't want I'd to like to three. say I should have uh, spent a point mm -hmm. on a prayer token before yep. I drew this. Hello to <laughs> one. One. Safe. Like, you like that. I like that either as well because I don't have to spend my token. One, but you probably two. get the worst if it's number three. Yeah. So can somebody maybe uh, write number, what number is that now? One, two, six. One, two, how many? Uh, still eight. eight. Still All eight. the volcanoes are still So we'll, we'll pick number eight next time we need to draw a volcano from top to bottom. So why and pick number six before? Yep. All right, Sorry. Uh, my third action. Mm -hmm. There's a few things I'd like to do. Yep. This creates a, a, a good slot for rolling the die. Yes. <laughs> what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this lava while it's here mm -hmm. and build another Moai. Mm -hmm. a good idea. Yep, because if you take it, then I've got to spend a bunch of actions to, to build more Moai here. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just risking, I'm risking both of them in an eruption, so it is a, a risk. And then the last thing I'm going to do is move this guy here, mm -hmm. because if he survives, if Stella sinks this part of the island on the next turn, mm -hmm. um, he He's too far away to to be saved. He can only go to an adjacent adjacent. That's space. correct. And he's worth four points mm -hmm. if he doesn't die. So okay, that is one action point uh, to save four points, and I think that's worth. All right, my go. So first action, you probably know what I'm going to do to go there. Second one is to do that. Put a channel there. Mm -hmm. And third action is to move here, and fourth is to erect it. Points for that <laughs> chain there. I've got to split them up. I don't I've got know. to try to sink that. Oh thing. no! Uh, look at that. So, oops, sorry. All right, so that is <laughs> one point. This is going to be a big eruption here. All right, one point for me only, measly point. Now, I'm going to roll the die. Uh, first, we sink this part because those volcanoes won't be in the. Oh, that's so right. We're losing four volcanoes all at once and a like, whole lot of building to like <laughs> 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 This guy is going to. <laughs> it's going to get like smaller and smaller. This guy's going to escape to here. Mm -hmm. Oops, sorry. Yeah. Actually, let's escape him to here. There's no lava in our spots. Sorry. So. And this is your thing gone? Yep. And all of these actually, unfortunately, sink into the ocean. And then we remove our five, six, yeah. 
seven and four. They're all mm. out. I feel like we sunk all of these volcanoes at the same time last time. It's a sound effect. Now let's just make it a bit centered and then zoom in a little bit. Yep. Um, all right. Let's just rearrange a little Oops. bit here. Uh, <laughs> this was easier. You just try. This Sorry. This is an easier idea yeah. in theory than in practice. Sorry. Okay. So we can zoom in a little bit better. Maybe. For the viewers. Yep. And I'll do it right now. There you go. Yep. Okay. Is it good, everybody? Yes. Is it good, Taran? Now it's a Oops. smaller area, um, and it's, it's just gonna get smaller and smaller. Yep. Okay. Let's bring. Ajahn's the here. Hello, Ajahn. Score sheet in. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, roll for eruption. Indeed. So I'm taking a, I'm now a one in four chance. Well, if you roll an eruption, it's a one in four chance. It's not. Yeah, no eruption. <laughs> Live to fight another day here. Yeah. All right, that's me, do me done. Okay. So how many hexes are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So. And there's no fishes on the island right now. So we've mm -hmm. got to cut off a section of uh, seven. Seven is the... Mm -hmm. You want your pieces to be in the eight. Okay. Hmm. One, two, three, four. <laughs> You're counting. All right. I will spend one. I'm going to put the giveaway password here so uh, people can uh, have a, got a chance to enter. I'll spend one to raise there mm -hmm. uh, and get some immediate points while it's on. So that is a six point Moai for me. Because I've got two villages and three Ooh. Moai in that area. Very lucrative. Um, I think you've got a lot on. of points from I'm gonna let me let me spend one to get my uh, yeah. prayer token first. Alright. So we do that. Then I build that fissure there. If there is an eruption. And it's number one, so that's this one here. Mm -hmm. Spits out some new building materials. Okay. <laughs> then I'm going to... Nothing much more for this guy here. So I'm gonna go three. Mm -hmm. No. Hmm. Mm, yeah, I will. I'll go. No, I'll go three. Three. <laughs> what? Th they didn't move? Four. Okay. I didn't move them. Okay. All right. All right, he's done? Yes. Hmm. What am I going to do, Tarrant? I think I'll go one, two is to build, three is to erect. Yep, okay, so that is uh, one point. Yep, measly one point. And eruption die. Thank you. No, eruption. No eruption. Um, got one more. Which... Probably going to take this guy over here. Ooh, okay. You've got to spin, no I? Ooh, mm -hmm. I don't like that. <laughs> 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 That's it. Your turn now. All right. So obviously this is now a, a battle for who can uh, carve off the other player's points. Uh, I'm going to raise one here. Of course. Yep, that's the right thing to do. Mm -hmm. So that is a one point Moai for me. Mm -hmm. 
And we do get an eruption of number two. So that is, that puts a lot of building materials up here on the north, mm. um, which could be influential. Because it was a bit starved there before, and now mm. there's a lot. Yeah. Um, but I think the, the sensible thing to do here is just to go straight in mm -hmm. to... Three, three. I don't like the look of these now. <laughs> <laughs> and oh no. four. So I make myself an adjacent pair and I start to make a cut here. Oh so, no. Okay, roll. Um, one point. Mm -hmm. I just missed the most of the beginning. Uh, we'll have to catch it later. Thank you. If you have any quick questions, let us know. No eruption. No eruption. This is this is bad. This is bad for me as well. Okay. I think one is to erect this. Build it, yep. Build it, sorry. Two is to erect. Ugh. Okay, so one point. Mm -hmm. And the dice. Yep is saying yes to something so it will be number eight number Over eight here nothing happens yeah nothing happens because it's already full uh, and then the next one is to wreck here what's the matter taran <laughs> <laughs> and i'm cutting on myself as well and let's throw the dice one point one point thank you and we'll See which one, number three. So that's this one mm -hmm. here. Um, so you want to save yours? Or are you just going to let it go sink? Let me think. So does that it's worth saving? Hmm. I don't think I'm going to be able to save that portion of the so island, sink it. So yeah, let's let's destroy. Sorry. It. All right. So I've got one more. Uh, which I'm going to move my person here. Okay. That's it. Okay. And let's turn all your action points on. Yep. All right, so I need to go into settler saving mode. I've got to make mm -hmm. sure that if you're the one who sinks this, mm -hmm. maybe I should sink it because I can. Oh, it'll only it'll be a four point moai if I mm -hmm. um, if I sink it, but I don't have to go one, two, grab three, four. You could sink so, it before I got there. Uh, for Ajahn who just joined us, or, or those who just joined us, who basically uh, end game trigger when there's only two, and we trying to sink opponent's stuff by separating the islands and this is the battle that me and Terrans uh, are doing at the moment <laughs> just trying to sink each other um, good thing we don't fight if we <laughs> don't if I sink yours and you sink mm. mine um, all right I think kind of like area influence area controlish style yeah. and you got um, end game point sorry yes yeah. all right there's a lot of lava here and I can start cutting that away mm -hmm. so that's the thing to do so one two oh no three because it's got adjacency as well <gasps> all right so mm -hmm. then that's one point for me mm -hmm. did you raise any moai last time i thought i did did you get points i think so okay i don't remember no Yeesh. eruption. One more. And then one more is... Four. Because I know he's worth... Got a... Oh, actually. Oh, I only get to rescue one per area. Oh, 
One per area, as in per hex or per... Per area. Okay. You probably want to refresh that. I forgot about that as well. Yeah, I might... I'll lay this back down. Mm -hmm. Take off the point. You haven't erupted anything, right? Um, I rolled a, I rolled a no eruption. Mm. So. I'll let it go. That's okay. It's a friendly... Um, agents, agents, map, map tiles looks cool. It is, it is very, um, very cool. And that's kind of like 3D. It's got a bit of a treble, um, table presence there See from the side. It looks like this new settings works. Look like, um, there's no lag or everything looks like it. Yep. Okay. I'm done. Okay. You done? Yes. I think I'm, I think I'm protected. Hmm. Hopefully it's clear from above what's what. I think it is. Um, certainly the yeah the Moai are the ones on the mm -hmm. on the things. What other colours is that? The um the other uh, the other the other player colours are red and blue. I should probably like the red because it's yellow seems a little bit blend in. Yeah. Anyway, that's that's fine. Made yep. a choice. Gosh, what am I going to do here? Do I save myself or do I kill Darren? <laughs> uh, one. So if this cut off, I can go there and then go there, right? Uh, yes. I mean, one per area, did you say? Uh. Oh, what's he doing there? I missed him. Did you say one per area? One, if if you're the inactive player, one mm -hmm. per area. So is there any way to stop that from happening? Because that's really bad. Like, I've got a lot of points here and it's going to get cut off. It's really sad. Um, it's... I don't think there's any way to prevent uh, that area from sinking, I guess. It's tough. It's tough once again, once the board emerges in mm -hmm. a certain way, um, it's... You kind of have to have worked in advance to cut off to cut mm -hmm. off another area first, mm -hmm. to prevent it from happening. Or you can use fissures to stop people from moving. But in this case, I am in a position I to know. cut that off inside three actions. Oh, that's so bad. So if I move here, oh, this is like one, two, three, four. 16 points they're gone plus the adjacency on that one <laughs> although you were going to cut that in there i'm so sad uh, uh, well actually there is a way um if i i'm i'm thinking if i actually put my moai there and then not erect it that means that's gone if you use yeah up the lava, that's that's yes. what i'm thinking uh, but you can still, it's not stopping you from bringing in from outside because you can carry more. It just might take longer and you might be able to, I don't know, cut something else or stop me I from... I know, but this is definitely what I have to do. Um, so this is safe, right? This can go there if it sinks and this can go there if it sinks one per area. Yes. And then I will, but this is going to be gone. Yep. <sighs> <laughs> this is not looking very good for me. So, uh, one is here. Um, he was kind of on the board. He's on the he's board. On here. He needs to be in here. Yeah. And then the second one, uh, the next one is to bring it here. Yep. And to erect it here at the last one. So I get two points here. Uh, I guess, oh, we've got a subscriber. There's was like a noise notification. Hmm? What was it? One, two, three. Do you still have one left? Oh, no, I moved the, this guy oh, here. Okay, yeah, let's get him to. So the it's there. And okay. that means that is all gone. Yep, so you get two points for that moai. Yeah. Why two? Because uh, two moai times oh, right, one yeah, village. Yeah, yeah. Forgot. Ooh, you've um, got a good chain of moai there, actually. Yeah, but you're going to sink it anyway. you got a good chain there. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> Oh yeah. Okay. Right. Um, so, <laughs> so that's gone. Uh, so, so you, you can save points. your I can save him person. and he's going to jump there. Mm -hmm. So this is gone. So number three also gone. 
Take number three out of the... It's like rumbling. Out of the way. Yeah. Away from the game. So only one more volcano <laughs> needs to sink before the game ends. Stephen, say sink! Yes, it sinks. <laughs> oh my god. This is so close. All right. Okay. Uh, I've got no action left. Um, you got to roll the. Of course, yeah. Yep. Corruption die. Number two. Number two. So over here, nothing mm -hmm. much happens there. Mhm. Mm it's only three, right? Only three. Yeah. I I can end the game um, this turn, and it would you can. because I was the first you player. You can. Because I was the last player. That's basically it. So if you sink this area, that means that's the end of it. Maybe that's probably a good idea before I sink other things. Yeah. And I think I can... I think I've got I the... I think you got it. It'll be close, but I think I've got the... Um, upper hand? Upper hand. You've yeah. got that one extra village. We've both got one of those. So that means when you trigger the end, I don't get an extra turn. Is that what happened? Correct, okay. yes. One, two, three, oh. four. Yes, I can do it. All right. I think Harry so got this. I bring him in here mm -hmm. for one so that I can save him from sinking. sinking. Mm -hmm. Then the second action to raise this for one, one point. And um, Fisher here. Yep. And oops. Yep. And there is an eruption. Mm -hmm. Of number one. Which is that one, yep. Which is here, so we place a whole lot more lava. Mm -hmm. And then third, I'm gonna build a Moai there. Mm -hmm. And fourth, I'm gonna raise it. Ooh. So I get one more point. <laughs> and oh no, I've got a lot of lot here, people. This area uh. sinks, so we both. We because this is a smaller area, so this area is the one that sinks, right? Yeah. It's the rules. So we're going to save. I can save as well. Did yep. I save it? Um, I saved them for it you. It doesn't matter. Because the game end is triggered. There's yep. now only two volcanoes left on the island. Correct. Right. Right, volcano number two. Mm -hmm. uh, there is technically an eruption, but I don't think it matters eight. eight is full anyway no one yeah. went over to number eight yeah um the two-player game sort of emerges out into the island yeah and that is the end Ooh. so um it is we now go to an end game score start here. swimming people say <laughs> <laughs> yes Terrence, so start swimming. i think We've got very similar that's left, mm -hmm. um, so I think we are going to. I think I'm going to have a. I think you're going to win because you're already in ahead in the scoring. Yeah, you've got a village. That's really the only difference at this point. So, mm -hmm. each leftover village is worth three points. So Should we go to the side camera? Now it's small enough. You can adjust a slight side camera forward. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yes. Okay. All the Moai are facing away. Mm -hmm. This is like bad Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> bad Instagram. <laughs> All right. So the end game points, mm -hmm. it, it'll be a mess if we try. Yeah, okay, it. yeah. So you've got one village left. I have none. So you get three points. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. I think we each have all five of our settlers left. Uh, you don't have any behind. One, I two, see. three, four, five. Yep, they one, all survive. Yeah, so, so four 20. points per settler, 20 points each. So just drop it down two rows. Yeah, thank you. Um, then each unspent prayer token is worth two points. We both have one of those. Mm -hmm. And each Moai is worth... Well, two we've got really similar. They're very similar. So each Moai is worth two points if it's alone or four if it's adjacent. We each have four, four in a row, so that's 16 points apiece. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then... One, two, three, four, five. Six. I think that's it. And that is it. Wow, Taryn, well done. Well done. Congratulations. Sorry, I'm like, yes. congratulations. <laughs> so, yeah, we. Wow. Um, well, you finally won. Yes, you've won the first two games of yeah. this we played. Well um, done. We played a four player game where the scores were much higher than this. Yeah. Um, and you had just a good cluster in the middle. Mm -hmm. I remember it was. Um, 
Yeah, a cut, one of the players, just all the stuff got sunk mm -hmm. and they finished a distant last. Yeah. And um, I had a lot of end... If I remember correctly, I was behind that had a lot of endgame points in that one. That's true. It's like, it's, there's a lot of strategy you can do in this game here. Um, so Marie says, um, like that angle. Okay, we'll put it there. Like a run out. Oh, thank you. Um, the Sean... Okay, they were originally eight full cannons. So it's now down to two, which is the um, end game trigger. Yes. Um, yeah, it's just, it's good terrible present. There's a lot of strategy whether you want to kind of like want to build it in one area and then fight with opponents or you want to build like separately in the four players you've got no choice. Um, it's still cutthroat in two players. We thought originally it's going to be not cutthroat but it really depends what you want to do. You can focus on building your own or you can focus on cutting your opponents off as well. Yeah, it's like it is critical in two player to mm -hmm to see where the board lies and work out how you're going to be on the biggest piece. Yeah. Because if you get carved off in small chunks, then mm -hmm. then you're going to lose. But then at the same time, yeah. if you've got, if you're folk, the more cuts you make, the yeah. more small pieces you try to cut off. Yeah. Um, I've tried to cut you off like so many times yeah. and then at the end I got cut off. So this is like, this is the board game pieces with, like plastic volcanoes, it's quite cute. Yeah. Did they say that they give us a, a separate something? Was it? I can't remember. I can't was remember. it origin? So yeah, like this makes it it doesn't sit flat, but that's okay because it's yeah. just part of the setup. So there mm. we go. That was a um, a nice close little two player game. Mm. We actually had a very <laughs> similar, similar similar island. Yeah. Um, rescuing the settlers is a critical part of mm. it, and. Um, good game, Tara. There you go. Good well game. Well done. Enjoy that. Yes, I'll do the laundry. <laughs> All right. Well, now we're going to um, give one last chance for those who has not entered the competition. So we're going to go back to us um, so that we can put the password yeah. up in the screen. So email us to mibble.university.giveaway at hotmail.com with the subject line Easter Island. So um, thank you for the uh, note as well. We one day will do a kind of like play along sort of um, cartographer or welcome to, that'll be fun. Yep. Uh, most probably not, go uh, there's not going to be giveaway. So uh, we're just gonna just play games together. Yes. Just fun. So Taryn's mm -hmm. gonna explain something. Yep. Um. Oh, um, also, it, this is um, sponsored. This is message from sponsored. Yes. So Ar Ark and Wonders is our, well, the one that's provided the giveaway and us, which is ourselves. We are our own sponsor, so it will help us if you um, hit that smash, uh, smash that like button, hit that smash, <laughs> and then um, yeah, subscribe if you haven't already done so. Now, Taryn's going to mention something. I'm gonna give it back to the uh, main layout. So, uh, why I'm asked if anyone from uh, Canada stay safe, please. The air quality is uh, really bad. Oh, really? So what happens? What happened? Um, is air quality? I'm not in sure. I know, I know there's. Tell us. I know there's um, bushfires going on in California oh no. at the moment. So it goes up um, but that way. Uh, it's, a, it's a long way up for it to blow. It would have to go over the Rockies for that. Oh no. Um, so I'm not sure if that's the cause or if it's... Uh, it's like make it mute. Well, okay, else. I'll let Taryn um, explain about the rest while I uh, go and uh, prepare the, um, the giveaway. Yep. Yeah. Yes, so um, one thing I was... Off. So what I was going to uh, show you as part of this is that there are additional pieces. Uh, so what we played with was the basic board setup. It's a small. Oh, sorry, California, not Canada. California. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So what we um, set up was a smallish, um, a smallish island, but it's sort of the basic island uh, in the rule book. But you can set up the game with many different islands, and there are more pieces beyond the ones that we just showed, uh, which allows you to set up a larger island for a longer game as well. Potentially a longer game. I mean, you can just cut it off in larger chunks, but uh, so you've got that flexibility, but you'll always have those eight volcanoes to start with. There'll be these few larger areas and then a whole lot of areas with non-replenishing lava. So yeah, a bit of flexibility in the way you set up this game. Uh, you can also all start from different corners of the island if you want. Um, which I'm not sure if I'd want to actually. I quite like the um, the concept of an area control game where everyone's starting from the same corner and fanning out and trying to cut off bits of the island. 
uh, actually works really well in this context. It's a different sort of uh, different sort of strategy to think through. Um, but yeah, so that is volcanic. Oh. So we've got 19 people. We've oh, we're 19. 19? Yeah. Okay, so we will set up the wheel uh, shortly coming across as I play with these little moais again. They're very, <laughs> very cute. That's, I, there's something about moai. I think there's, I can think of three games that use them. Mm -hmm. uh, or Tarago doesn't quite, is it called Tarago? Not Tarago, that's a car. What's the one? Tobago. 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 <laughs> Tobago. Okay, um, they sort of have Moai figures. And then there's Orongo. Um, there we go. We've got the wheel up. So we'll shuffle the wheel. We'll see if the Meeple wins for the third week in a row. Uh, let's spin. So whichever number comes up, we will go through chronologically on the emails that were sent to us and pick a winner. So it looks like it's going to be the fourth email. Congratulations, number four. Let's find out who that is. Find out who will be winning a copy of Volcanic Isle. Oh, thanks to Arcane Wonders. Thanks to Arcane Wonders. All right. What number was that again? Number four. Thank you. All right. One, two, three, four. Scott. Scott. Scott Nelson. Congratulations, Congratulations Scott. Congratulations, Scott. I hope you enjoy. Throw confetti here just for Scott today. Yep. Hopefully you enjoy. Volcanic Island. So um, Stella will get in contact with you to get yes. your details, which will then pass on to Arcane Wonders, mm -hmm. and I'll send through a copy of this little fun little area control volcanic game. And thank you everyone for joining us again as usual. Uh, next week we are going to play something else. We haven't decided what we're going to play, but we'll be here. Hopefully we'll see you again and see. Um, I don't know what happened yet. Hopefully everyone's in um, California. It's like it's all good. Because I don't want anyone to kind of, <laughs> yeah. it's not going to be good. Um, so yeah, thank you again for everybody. And um, anything else, Taryn, that you want to say? Um, no, nothing else. I think that's mm. uh, that's it for this game. It was a fun game. Yeah. And um, yes, everyone, stay safe till next time. Yes, thank you. Until next time, bye. Bye.